Look, if you'd have gone into London 400 years ago, at the dawn of the Industrial Revolution, where, where there were terrible problems with money, money wasn't working very well at all, there was a lack of circulating medium of exchange, there were problems with coin clipping and all this sort of thing. And if you'd said to people, well, what kind of money would you like in the future? They would have probably come up with all sorts of interesting variations on, on silver coins and you know, made all sorts of suggestions to how the, the Royal Mint could be made more efficient and things like that. But they probably wouldn't have said, well, what if we had some sort of central bank? You know, what if we had five pound notes? What if we had a gold standard? And yet all of these things came to pass within a generation. I think we're in a similar sort of situation. We're trying to imagine what the money of the future will be. But all we've done so far is we've kind of electronified that money of the Industrial Revolution. We haven't yet created the new digital money for the new age.